welcome to the new week. Um, this is what I look like after I've been watering. Because <laughs> it's lots of, you know, gymnastics to get between all the pots. Uh, just watered. It's the afternoon. I try to water in the morning, but Georgie had a vet appointment. Um, and I needed a bit of a break. This is, this is the week that the, um, what's it called? That Reddit forum is staging that coop online with, what's it called? GameStop? Ga Game Store? GameStop? So, I've been following that. Um, but the plants are the first love, of course. So I've been watering. This week I repotted that dubia, or rather potted it, the monstera. It's been on just the little slab of wood with, I don't know if it's real or fake moss, that it got shipped with for a couple weeks while it acclimated. I decided to finally put it in a pot. Um, that fake cork tree, I don't know if I mentioned it last time, but it's just way too top heavy. I need to move it out to my shed and just give up on it or something. Um, all I know is it's annoying me that it's hanging out in the shower because it's a mess and I hate messes. What else? Um, the guy who did the shed roof said he would be back this week to tape up the the small holes with the... There's like a piece at the top of your shed roof that all the way at the top they put this row at the peak of the roof. That's for ventilation so air can get out so you don't have humidity condensing up there. Well instead of just putting it... So if these are the ends of the shed and this is the peak of it. Instead of just putting it smack in the middle like it was before, they put it all along so there's kind of vents on the sides and I told them, well, I don't want wasps and hornets and stuff deciding that they want to go nest in there through those vents. So, like, silicone it or something because that's not what it looked like before. He said he would be back. He wasn't back. I'm not surprised because I'd already paid him. <laughs> I mean, fine, I can get some outdoor weatherable silicone and plug it myself. It's only a strip this big and it's maybe like this thick or something. So bugs probably wouldn't get in there, but I'm a little paranoid. I don't want to open up my shed and have surprise nest, you know? Um, what else? Right, so he had fixed the inside of the bathroom where the roof was leaking too, so that's all fixed, which is nice. Um, I... I find myself having a reasonable amount of work instead of an unreasonable amount of work. We'll see if I manage to do some spackling tomorrow. It's supposed to start snowing tonight or tomorrow, so um, if I'm going to be stuck inside anyway. Today I just kind of, I needed a day off. Um, and I sort of heard back with an email from that job that I had applied to. It wasn't really an answer. You know, the way that they do if they're, like, still deciding stuff or asking HR about things or whatever. So, still on hold for that, but my job is, you know, decent. So, fine. I'll keep holding. Um, trying to think of what else was going on. I don't even know. Maybe I finally cleared most of the deck of the stuff that I needed to do. I still need to finish my filing. Um, I'm thinking about getting one of those uh, ugly, small, little, maybe personal pan pizza size ceramic backyard, like, fish or frog-shaped or whatever pizza ovens that are all of, like, I don't know, 50 or 100 bucks to burn some papers in because... True to coronavirus, I'm trying to stay home and not go out and not go find a shredder, so maybe I'll just burn it in my yard, and then at some point maybe I can even make pizzas in it. We'll see. I think those have like a high burn yourself rate though, so maybe that's not the toy for me, being as clumsy as I am. Um, I'm looking at the quarter round here. It was supposed to get installed at the bottoms of the, the walls where they had polished those floors and um, 
I might have missed the boat on refinancing the house to get a lower interest rate because I think they're going back up again. And if I did that, I'd want everything looking pristine for a reappraisal. So I'd want to get that installed. Seems like a lot to get done in a short amount of time. I don't think I'd be able to do it. And I don't think I could have done this any faster. So <laughs> here's to hoping that I win the lottery so that I can just immediately pay off the house and not pay that interest rate or something. <laughs> uh, here's, here's that dubia. Hopefully you can see that. I have it bagged because it was in a bag, and here's a couple um, other monsteras that I have kind of rooting or acclimating. What else? That crispy fern downstairs still looks kind of crispy. Oops, but I mean, I have four others. I shouldn't be greedy. Um, oh, and I tied up the rest of the monsteras try to get them to actually climb because that's how you get them to have those nice big fenestrated leaves and uh, maybe that's about it for this week because last week was a little long maybe this week will be a little short uh, those pygmy dews are slowly all starting to sprout I have too many plants <laughs> okay um I'll get back to Georgie, have to have a bath after the vet visit. Yep, that's it. If I think of anything else, I'll tack it on to the end. Till next week.